Hi guys, so it's just about time for June favorites, but I wanted to switch it up just a little bit since now um, summer is officially summer, everyone's out of school, and everything's basically full swing for summer. I wanted to give just summer favorites. So it's June favorites, but um, that things that were my favorite throughout June, but it's also things that I think um, are pretty much going to be my favorite throughout the summer, things that I think are going to be um, helpful and really great to use during the summer. So... Let's start about that. I know I told you guys that I was going to do um, a video on the feather extensions so that I'm sure you could see the purple and the blue. Um, and I'm going to do them. I'm probably going to do it next week only because um, I have a whole kid here and I wanted to be able to show you uh, how to remove and put one in. So I want to uh, kind of work with that a little bit. And I also wanted to find a few more sites because right now a lot of them are... Uh, back ordered and sold out so I wanted to have a list of sites that I can give you guys that had them in stock I didn't want to give you information that was inaccurate um, so we're going to talk about summer and first thing we're going to talk about is body care then makeup then nails and then that should be it um, so the first thing is body care and first thing which I always stress now is sunscreen I'm really liking this La Vanilla sunscreen this is the SPF 40 it's the healthy sunscreen it has UVA and UVB protection. I got this from drugstore.com and uh, this is $28 for 1.8 ounces. Quite frankly, I like it a lot, but I was able to get it uh, essentially free because I had a gift card. Um, so if, you, if that's too much, obviously, which I don't blame you, it probably is, um, try the Neutrogena one. I use that quite often and it's comparable, honestly. Uh, the only thing it doesn't have is the whole healthy factor. Another thing I love is for my hair, and this is the um, Sexy Hair Concepts Soy Renewal. So this is Healthy Sexy Hair. I think I've probably showed this to you guys before. And this is the Soy Renewal. It's a nourishing treatment with argan oil. And it has, um, it's an oil, and you put it in your hair when your hair is wet. And what this does is it actually reduces drying time. So you can, air, it'll air dry quicker or it'll blow dry quicker, which is really great because in the summer you don't want to, first off, you don't want that much heat on your hair in the first place. But you really don't want to be sitting there under a hair dryer or a hot iron in the summer. It's just uncomfortable. Um, and if you're air drying, to air dry it um, quicker, it's helpful because then it has less of a chance of frizzing, at least in my experience. Another thing that I love is um, the Dove Ultimate Visibly Smooth um, Deodorant. It's kind of a silly thing to show, but this is the one that's supposed to make uh, minimize the visual appearance of hair over time. Uh, it makes hair under your arms softer and less visible so this is pretty awesome to use it takes a little while but eventually it does work and on the same note token as that this is the Noxzema visibly smooth um, shaving cream and this does the same thing it has kappa slow and this helps minimize hair uh, regrowth for lasting smoothment, smooth, uh, smoothness um, and this is cucumber melon I had some trouble finding this in the store I used to get this at either Walmart or Target so I actually had to go to when I went to drugstore.com I saw it there so I bought a few tubes um, this takes about half um, about half a can of getting through to finally see results. But when you do, basically, the um, everything grows in. I use this on my legs and on the underarms. And it, everything grows in a little thinner and slower. So instead of, like, every other day you have to shave, maybe, like, every three days you'd have to shave. Because the stubble just isn't as noticeable for at least two days after you shave. Which, during the summer, you're wearing shorts and dresses and stuff and you want to be smooth. And there's nothing more annoying than having to shave every day or you know, waking up the next day after you shaved and feeling prickly all of a sudden. It's just so frustrating. Um, and another thing, just because uh, I had this issue the other day, um, was bug spray. I went to my brother's baseball game and I had mosquito bites all over the place. So I went and bought some bug spray and I've been trying it since then. And this is Natural Herbal Armor. I got this at Target. It was like four fifty, And this is um, pretty natural. It has uh, soybean, citronella, peppermint, cedar, lemongrass, and geranium. Um, which is pretty good, so you're not uh, filling yourself full of chemicals. It's water and sweat resistant, and it's just a spray. It's four ounces, and it's cruelty free. And this is all terrain natural herbal armor and such repellent. And I had no issues with this the other day. Okay, um, okay. So on to the makeup. I showed this to you guys a few. Um, I think this is one of my favorites a few months ago, but it's really been my favorite now that the weather's been getting hot. And this is the Sony Kashuk Radiant. Tinted moisturizer. I'd like you to be able to see what it says. Uh, yeah, it has SPF 15. 
um, and this is just a tinted moisturizer and of course you need your own sunscreen other than that but this is nice because it does just even out the skin tone uh, cover minor imperfections and take care of simple things like that and it's really simple you don't have to worry about application you just smush it on and you're all set uh, set it with a powder is also a really good idea another favorite of mine throughout summer and this has always been one of my favorites in summer and on just lazy days is the Urban Decay Primer Potion in Sin. This is obviously one of the old tubes now they're finally squeezing. Um, but this is great because it's a nice champagne color. And let me show you the color. This is the color right there. It's just a shimmery champagne. And this is it on my hand. And this is a primer. But what I do in the summer is I put it on the eyelid, which is what I did today. Just kind of smear it all over the eyelid. And then I just do a really light, I blend it out with my finger and then I put a light um, shimmer white highlight on the top. And then the corners, right now I have on a colored eyeliner, um, I think it's flip side from Urban Decay, and just black mascara. And it looks, it looks like you care, but it's really simple and it stays all day. So it's not bad at all. I also really like that because I've been using this a lot lately. This is a Lorac Little Black Parrot palette. Not parrot. Uh, this is, I think, 32. It's still available on Sephora.com. Um, I got this last year if you guys want to see a full review. Uh, it should be from like last August or September that I did the review, and I just dropped this. Uh, it comes with the eye primer, which is pretty good. Um, but it's all these golden shades and big shadows. And these are the colors. And they're really shimmery and foily, but they've been really great for the summer. This white champagne-y color has been gorgeous for um has been gorgeous for highlights and things like that. And this bronzy red color, they're all really beautiful and really pigmented and smooth. Um and I think they're really great for summer. They're kinda like to me, um gold is a nice way to experiment with color and not be so subtle but without being um too over the top too because metallic is kind of its own neutral. Um because metallic can go with anything and not really clash. And the last makeup thing that I really like is the NYC New York Color Lip and Large Lip Plumper. And this has probably been on like all my favorites. But I love this for summer because I usually use a stain during the summer, like Vanna Tint, Posy Tint, um, some of the Revlon ones. And then just to stick the stain over it, it makes um, your mouth look nice and glossy and the color will still stay under it. Um, and then. One of the other things I love for summer is from Lush. It's a silk stockings bar. I think it's considered a massage bar. But basically what this is, is you get it warm in your hands and the oil and cream kind of comes off. And it creates a shimmery, I don't know if you can see that, but it creates like a shimmery sheen. You can rub on your legs um, to kind of simulate the look of stockings without actually having to wear them. It's really great for whenever you wear a short skirt shorts dress anything like that during the summer and you can use it on your shoulders or on the bones here and it looks good too um and the last few things are nail polishes my favorite colors for this summer so far have been corals whites and like neutral blush kind of colors um so i've been using this white this is white on white from china glaze and i've been using that a lot uh i've been using powder puff from orly which is like an off white i'm sorry I really like OPI's Cajun Shrimp. And right now I'm wearing um, Barriel Santini, which is so bright, great for a pedicure. But I think my favorite of the summer is Sally Hansen Instant Dry in Peach, Peachy Breeze. Yeah, Peachy Breeze. So those have been my favorites for summer so far. I'm also going to do a video hopefully this weekend of um, my updated nail routine because you guys have been here for my acrylic recovery and this is where they are right now. They're getting pretty long and strong um, and I have new products and things like that that I've been using and I want to show you guys. So I hope you guys have a great day, have a great holiday weekend and I'll see you soon. Bye.